Hello everyone, this is Joe from CSO, and today we're going to be covering your new dashboard on our CSO website. As you can see, I'm logged in as a coordinator who's coordinating for multiple teams across multiple games. At the very top, I can see my matches for every single team. So in Valorant, Rocket League, and League of Legends, I have a team. And from week to week, I can see where these teams, who these teams are playing, when these teams are playing, and I can also choose to preview the match. I can cycle through each match using the arrows near the top right. However, we're going to take a look at this a little bit later in this video. Further down on the dashboard, I can see all the teams that are cor currently coordinating. So I can see all my Fortnite teams, my Rocket League teams, my Valorant teams, my League of Legends teams, and even my Overwatch team. The information for these teams will pop up under Conference, League, and Record. And currently, for the purposes of this video, only Valorant, League of Legends, and Rocket League has any information. Please be advised that this may be flushed out as the season continues, as more brackets are generated for tournaments such as Fortnite, and as your team continues on for their records. Further down, we can see the match history for one of the teams. This UI will be updated eventually to match teams who have a coordinator rostering for multiple teams and we also have a reminder to join the discord where you can go to get access to the administration help as well as contacting other teams at the very bottom we see the news and announcements channel and this is where we would post things such as our registration hub or other news such as our play sports acquiring Let's go back to the top of the page and take a look at the matches that we have on our roster. So we're going to take a look at the very first match that's for October 17th. And we're going to go ahead and preview this match. As you can see this takes us directly to the match page. So I've already talked to the coordinator on the other side and I know that we need to move this match one hour back to 3pm Central Standard Time. So I'm going to go ahead and set that reschedule real quick. For a deeper analysis on how rescheduling works, please take a look at our match page video that we've released. I'm confirming that the date and time are correct, and I'm gonna go ahead and send it to the opposing coordinator. After a short loading time, the reschedule request is sent, and the reschedule match option has grayed out. Now, the great thing about these new dashboards it, is it it allows you to see exactly which matches need to be rescheduled. So if I navigate to the other coordinators page, I'm currently on their dashboard and nothing's popping up. This is because I simply had the window open. Let me go ahead and refresh the page and see what happens. After a brief loading period, I can see this notification telling me that this match has requested a reschedule. As you can see, the other matches remain the same with the preview match linking towards the match page. Let's go ahead and navigate to October 17th and reschedule this match. Like we covered in our match page video, we're going to scroll down to about the middle of the page and see that we have a reschedule requested. We're going to review the proposed time and date, and we can either accept or deny the request. We're going to go ahead and accept because me and the coordinator on the other side have already agreed to this time off of the site. Brief loading sequence will occur and the reschedule is updated. You can see that the time is now updated to 3 p.m. CST and the reschedule match option reappears. If you ever want to navigate back to your dashboard, you can always click the icon in the top left and it will bring you back to your dashboard. And there we go! That's a walkthrough on how our new dashboards work on the CSL site. Please note that we'll be working on improving this system as the season continues. Thank you everyone and good luck this season.